Good day, everyone. Um, I've been seeing these new commercials on TV lately, uh, talking about how the uh, these new wind turbines and everything are going to power Australia, and that the government wants to take 2,000 megawatts of power from um, uh, from out of service and replace it with green technology. I just thought I'd demonstrate to you today exactly how much energy that is, that 2,000 megawatts. We can show you how much that is. So what I've done is I've built this turbine here which um, has, has uh, copper, copper coils inside and has these powerful magnets uh, fixed to a rotor and when the magnets pass the coils generates electricity and I feed the electricity out through these wires and I've changed the alternating current into a direct current which goes into this storage capacitor and I've got as a load a Phillips 50 watt 12 volt down light and just common in ordinary homes and what I've got here is and I've got some meters which can tell me the voltage and also the amperage and to get to calculate the power we can multiply the volts times the amps and that'll give us a pretty good value of how much power we get into the light bulb so what I'm going to do now is put the camera down and I'm going to turn the generator and um, I'll just read you out I'll have to read out the readings that I get on here and uh, as I do it and we'll be able to calculate how much power that I get into the light bulb and here you go Turn it up now. 10 to 12 volts and 4 amps. So 12 times 4, 48 watts I'm producing. And I'm starting to struggle. 10, 10 volts. Uh, 9. I can't do it anymore. So you can see that I had in this meter I had 10 volts and in this meter I had 4 amps and I mean I had 12 sorry 12 volts I got in here for most of the time times 4 amps so you can see here 12 times 4 equals 48 watts and these light bulbs are 50 watts so I lit it up pretty much full but you can see I'm puffed out and um, you just couldn't keep doing that for any period of time that's the most I can produce is about 50 watts for for about 20 or 30 seconds and uh, after that the body just burns out so if you consider now that the government wants to take 2,000 megawatts that's 2,000 million watts of power out of our system and replace it with the wind so that would be equivalent to having 40 million of these machines with 40 million men turning them constantly 24 hours a day just as you saw me do there that's, that's the equivalent of 2000 megawatts so um, I'd really like to know from Bob Brown Julia Gillard and Tim Flannery how they're going to produce all this power and how they know that the wind is going to give us all this power 24 hours a day 
What I was just going to show you an article, an article written by Nikola Tesla. Now Nikola Tesla was the inventor of alternating current motors. There's one here, another one here. Nikola Tesla invented all these alternating current motors, and this is what he says about the wind turbines. He says, unfortunately, the value of all these resources is very much reduced by periodic and casual variations, and we are driven to search for a source of constant 24-hour power comparable to that of the waterfall. Now, this is written in 1931, our future motive power. Now, if they had a thought that the wind could power our industries and power our homes in 1931, Nikola Tesla would have built it. But they knew that they couldn't do it, and that the same fact exists today, only on a greater scale. So, um, hope you enjoy this demonstration, and just to get it through to people exactly how much power this 2,000 megawatts is that the Gillard government wants to take from our energy grid and try to replace with green energy or from the wind or solar. It's equivalent to 40 million men working on these machines constantly 24 hours a day, turning them with all their might. That's the power that they want to replace. So just have a good think about that everyone and um, I just think we need to get rid of this government because they've gone crazy and they're never going to produce the things that they say they are. Thanks for watching.